Hi everybody, Jackie here. Welcome back to my channel. And today I have, uh, for me it's long awaited. I've been waiting a long time to do this. This video is about uh, showing all the things I'm going to be taking to the fa craft fairs that I'm involved in th this year. And I have uh, about a month between the first one and the second one. So if I see a bunch of one thing sells, then I have time to make more of it for the second craft fair. But before I get started showing you what I've created, I want to give a big shout out to uh, one of my friends. She uh, caught me in my local Dollar Tree Saturday night and she said, I know you. I know you from YouTube. And sure enough, that was me. And I want to say a great big shout out to Stephanie Y. Thank you for stopping and talking to me. And I sure do appreciate your uh, support. And I hope you do start making some earrings and showing them to us. Because I'm sure everybody would be interested in seeing them. Again, I felt, you know, big YouTubers have people come up to them and say, Oh, I know you from YouTube, but I don't have many subscribers, and I live in a little podunk town, and then here's somebody from my little podunk town actually knows who I am. So it was kind of exciting for me, and I hope it was exciting for you too, Stephanie. Okay, here we go. First thing, and this is going to be a lot of shuffling back and forth because I got stuff piled everywhere. I don't have a real big filming space, so I have to work with what I have. The first thing that I'm going to show you is my uh, bucket of suckers. And that's exactly what they are. They're suckers, and I will try to get it so that you can see. And they're just covered with paper and a little embellishment and a twine to hold them in place. And I'm not selling these. These are giveaways. Everybody that comes through will get a sucker. So I have 120 of them, and if they all go during the first craft fair, simple enough to make, easy peasy. The next thing I want to show you is something I was not going to do, but then I thought, well, I'll go ahead and try and see how this works. I made some sugar scrubs, and I only made five of each to start to see how they do. And this is the peaches and cream. You can say, well, I don't know if you can see, but it says peaches and cream on top. And I've got packaged up with some shred in the bottom and a little curly ribbon in a bag with uh, some bow, with a bow, and or some curling ribbon, I should say. And then this is the other one. This is the blueberry. And I can't really get to where I can show you the color of it. But it is like a lavender, and the peaches and cream is like a peach color. And like I said, I made five each of those to try them and see how they do. The next thing I'm going to take, and these, you're going to think I'm a drug addict because I keep scratching my nose, and I'm not. Sorry about that, folks. Um, I made these. They are called Christmas Photo Albums with the ribbon and the jingle bells. And every page has Christmas paper on it. And then you can either mount pictures on it, write on it, whatever you want to do. But each there's a each page front and back is the same paper all the way through. And I'm not gonna show you all the different ones, but you get the general idea. Okay, they're all Christmas papers with the snowman on the outside and like i said i made four of these and we're going to see how they do so and i thought well that looks easy enough maybe i can do that so we're going to try the next thing i'm taking to the craft fair are some mini traveler's notebooks and I don't have too many of them because they're a little more time consuming to make. But I am going to show you kind of what they look like. Each one has a butterfly on the front. It has the elastic closure. It comes with a pen. You can't really see from the top, but it comes with a decorated binder clip and a decorated paper clip. And each one includes... A sheet 
of stickers. That's what they are, stickers. So I have that one, and I'm going to show you these real quick just so you can see which stickers I'm sending. This is like ballerinas. This one is cactuses. This one is a little bit bigger one, and it's about family and home is where the heart is. This one is all butterflies. This one is the pineapples. This one is flowers. And the last one is butterflies. So I think I have eight or nine of these that I'm taking. We're going to see how they do. I don't know, you know, how, how they're going to sell. But the thing about it is that if I don't sell anything, I'm really not upset because it gave, I have the joy of making it and figuring out how to do it, and that um, I have nieces and nephews, and three of them have like eight teachers apiece, and the other one, I don't know how many teachers she has, so I make teacher gifts every year, so I'll have all kinds of stuff to put in goodie bags for teachers. Okay, the next thing I did, and I'm, there's three, this one is not quite as filled as the other ones, let me get it out of the way that's the second one full of them oh lord i'm running out of room and this is the third one of them and what these are are hot cocoa pockets they're made out of envelopes and each one has a hot cocoa and you can't really tell but each one has a candy cane and then it has a amp Andy's mint in each one and they're made out of different paper. I've got the Santa Claus and I've got penguins and I wanted to show you one of the other ones so they're probably in a different and then I made several out of the paper that's the truck paper there you could see the candy canes much better and the candy bar is slid down but it's just little you know for one cup of hot cocoa it's just a little pack for one cup of hot cocoa next and i think i have like 70 of these summer christmas and summer just every day and i really shouldn't have packaged everything up because now i can't really show you but they're called uh, wallet notebooks and I think I'm just gonna get a Christmas one and show you what I'm talking about I'll just open it up and show you because they're easy enough to reseal see here I go fumbling again I always fumble with something during a video it wouldn't be me if I didn't let me get it out Okay, it's just called a little pocket notebook. And as you can see, it's got a belly band on there to keep it closed when it's in your, it's a wallet notebook while it's in your purse. And you slide that off and you open it up and it's just a little notepad. Just a plain little notepad to keep in your wallet. And I, like I said, I have about 70 of these. Some for all occasion, you know, just any time of the year, and some that are for mostly just for Christmas. And move those. Not all of them. Yeah. Okay. I think I made like only 10 of these, but what they are called. Sorry, I'm trying to get. The, it is called a, a sticky notepad, like a post-it. It's a, it's a holder for it. As you can see, it's self-contained, and it comes with a little decorated pen. And it's in the Christmas. 
And I, yes, I did all those in Christmas. Next, I did, these are called matchbook notebooks. They open like a matchbook does. And there's four in a package that I'm selling, and each one is different. And most of them are all occasion. But let me find, because I know I've got Christmas ones. I just got to find them. But I've got a bunch of those in Christmas, too. Okay. Yeah, I still got stuff over there. I was thinking, oh, my God, I'm losing it. Here we go, trying to fumble this, opening something else up. Good Lord, Jackie. Get your act together. Now, what I have here, these are little booklets that I made. Each one comes with a decorated Christmas pen, if you can see there at the top. And it's four handmade Christmas cards in each one of these. And I think I have like 40 of these that I have made. As you can see, I've mostly got everything geared for Christmas because it's that time of the year. But I do have some other things, you know, other themed things for the people that uh, don't want just Christmas. And here's another container. And what these are, these are little hand sanitizer holders. I don't know, in some of my previous videos, I kept talking about wanting to find the, uh, now I can't even think of what kind of dye it is. It's, oh, a pillow box dye to make the pillow boxes, and I never could find one, and it was just driving me crazy, but I finally found a woman on uh, YouTube who showed how to do these, and you don't need a, a dye to do it, and you just simply open them up. Oh, no, these are not the uh, hand sanitizer ones. These are the chapstick ones. And they'll have a little chapstick in each one. And this one is cherry. And I probably have about 40 of those. That's why I couldn't see, because they were piled on top of the other ones. And let me see if these are the ones. I also have these like this, and I'm not going to dig them all out, but they have the hand sanitizer in them. I don't know if you can see the colors on that one, the blue and the white. But I have some that have the hand sanitizers in them also. Then, I know I'm missing stuff. I made some of these, and again, I'm going to show you a Christmas one. And I will just take it out of the package so you see what it is. Like I said, I shouldn't have packaged everything up or I should have unpackaged stuff before I got ready to sit down and do this video. And this is just a little notebook that you can keep in your purse. And it's you can see it's got a binding on it. It comes with a little decorated pen and it's got the ribbon on it to keep it closed. And when you open it up, it has a notepad on each side, and then when you lift that, there's the other, there's decorated paper. So, you know, these won't last forever or anything, but you can always buy the little pads and replace them if you're so inclined. And I'll fix that in a minute. And then lastly, and I'll show you some that are Christmas and some that are not. I've got handmade Christmas cards. And they're not the biggest ones in the world. They're smaller. And the reason why is they're the correct size to put like a gift card in. And I'll have two different kinds. It doesn't look like it there, does it? It looks like, no, oh yeah, that one's ornaments and that one's candy cane. And I have two different ones in each bag, each package. And I have like 40 or 50 of these. But... I also have some, just, <coughs> excuse me, please, like some regular, that are just regular all-occasion cards. You can write a little note on and stick it in a gift or whatever you'd like. Just today, it says today on the back of it. 
And like I said, I'm not showing you all of any one kind of thing. I'm just showing you some of the stuff, showing you some of everything that I did so you can see, kind of have an idea of what I've got going on. The only thing I've, I've not been able to show yet, and I don't know if I can find one, is the hand sanitizer. Nope, I got another lip balm. Sorry, and I got off screen, and I didn't mean to do that. But like I said, I also have these with hand sanitizers in them. So everybody, that's it. That's what I've done for the craft fair so far. I have another idea or two in mind that I can whip up pretty quick, but I just don't know. I think I'm going to wait and see how my first craft fair goes. And then after that, then I can, uh, if I need more of any one thing, I have a couple ideas of things, uh, some Christmas journals to make that you make out of Christmas cards. They're easy peasy. So I have a few ideas in case I need more things. But that's it. That's all. There ain't no more. That's it. I just wanted to show everybody what I've been working on. I know I've been talking about a craft fair for a while. And please remember, I only started crafting a little over a year ago. So I'm not good at this. This is my first attempt at trying to sell any of it. And who knows if I will or if I won't, but I'm going to try. It's just something to occupy my time and, you know, keep me busy. Okay, everybody, I'd like ask you to please uh, subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell to be notified when I upload future videos. You could share it. You could like it. All that stuff is greatly appreciated. And remember what I say all the time. It's not my circus and they're not my monkeys. Y'all have a good day now.